What is going on, YouTube Nation? This is Dark Dividend. If you guys are new to my YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. So I haven't revealed to you my dividend income last month. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Uh, but I want to show you the changes. And really, this is the best month ever on M1 Finance and E-Trade combined. So I'll go over my dividend income. I'll go over my dividend investing strategies with you guys and what I plan on doing. I'll go, go over a brief overview and there might be some surprises. Actually, I'll show you the surprise on my M1 Finance dividend portfolio later this week. But again, there is a special on M1 Finance. If you sign up, you get $50. Actually, we both get $50, so you can use my affiliate link and capitalize on that if you want to make an M1 Finance dividend portfolio. And I guess there were some issues. I'm going to have to call M1 Finance myself after my exam this week and see what the heck's going on. I guess there were problems with people trying to use my replica remember my replica isn't complete it's a good foundation but you know i don't have my sectors yet so i mean once i get really big that would be a good starter pack i might just make some for you uh, the high yield ones or and stuff that would be pretty beneficial to you guys i think and you know, implement Matthew Ramey's dividend investing strategy. That can probably add QYLD, RYLD, and XYLD, some monthly dividend stocks to that. That way you can make some monthly dividends and quarterly dividends and make dividends uh, you know, each month. So that could be beneficial to you guys. So let's go over this dividend income right now on both of these. So let's check these out. Look at this dividend income that I've been earning, especially at the end of the year, which is really attractive. So new C I made three fifty seven. This is in December. Uh, Pine I made four dollars and ninety cents. Main Street Capital one nineteen. Devo I made two fifteen. Then C S W C, which is a really high yield dividend stock. Um, it's a B D C. Uh, it's thirteen sixty. I made on the thirty first. L T C eight ninety seven. So this B Y P M. I think this is like a thing that like broke off and I received some income, and I actually sold these guys right around this time. The BIP, I don't have them anymore. Actually, it's a really good one. That's one you can look into as well. So let's start with the dividend income, and I calculated everything right here. Uh, TELUS, so remember if it's, you can get a deduction because sometimes being international, you get de uh, deductions. So I made 206, I made 175 total i calculated that you know addition and subtraction yep 380 uh, bypm you know that series class thing it's just i i don't know what the heck happened with m1 finance with that maybe i'll get rid of it finally um iron mountain i made 3724 vc 763 qyld i made 1864 with that special dividend ryld 1245 xyld uh 673 plus 224 so I made 897 with that. So again, the goal is to get around you know $100 each of these and then that way I can start buying the quarterly dividend stocks and the quarterly dividend stocks will start buying these guys. So excellent dividend income from these guys and XYLG I'm going to try to add on there. I like that one. I'll probably do a review on that and I'm surprised M1 Finance didn't add it yet. Altria 2285 Healthcare Trust of America 275. MPW 560, Pembina with a deduction. I got 281. Spirit Realty Capital 1083. Agree Realty Corporation 132. Main 255. There's this pre split thing with um, the. the it, this is really weird with SLG. I, I read it and I'm like, whatever. Um, BCE again, the international thing. It's two two sixty three minus thirty nine cents. I, it's two twenty four. Uh, Doc Physicians Realty Trust four forty eight. Aries Capital Corp five seventy six. New C three thirty two and NRZ four sixty two. So again, the referral um, was helpful. So if you're interested, use my affiliate link. You get fifty dollars right off the bat. So I calculated everything. I made a total of $159.61. So that is an improvement. I'm almost at the 200 mark on my M1 Finance Dividend Portfolio, which is great. 
and that's exciting. It's everything's reinvested. I know people are asking me, do I reinvest, reinvest? Well, of course. Why, why you know, making 159.61, I mean, I'm making a car payment, you know, less than that, but now's the time to reinvest. So that's the big thing that's important is reinvesting your dividends. I'm treating this as a retirement pension. I'm 36 years old and I'm making $159.61 just sitting on my ass doing nothing. That's hard work paying off. I mean, I'm telling you, people are like, oh, I don't have enough money. Do some side hustles. Bartend, you know, obviously don't drink in the job, but I know some people that bartend and, you know, for a side hustle and you can throw it into IRA, max down to IRA, pay off debt. There's a lot of things you can do with side gigs um, alongside your actual job. I'm very fortunate being a res registered nurse. They're offering us a lot of money to pick up and I'm doing that. But the problem is, you know, being in graduate school now, it's like, uh kind of sucks, you know, because I would love to pick up and, you know, work an extra eight hour shift and make a lot of bonus money to throw in my dividend portfolio or, you know, pay off car debt. And then I, I think I about, got about 3000 left in my car, um, which is like nothing. But, you know, that's the thing about picking up side gigs or, or busting your ass and having things come back to you. And again, YouTube, sure, I'm making revenue. That's more, you know, stuff for paying for my utilities right now. I actually want to be responsible towards earning my money and then just reinvesting. And yes, yeah, some YouTube income, it's, it's actually paying for my graduate school, which is very nice. Let's jump to E-Trade. Right now, my estimated income, $1,837.95. That's not guaranteed, but look at these things that are coming up. Gain, I'm making 1268, NHI 2419, EPR 1763. These monthly dividends are kicking in. Oh, stag. HTBK. Remember, I said on my previous videos, this is a bank stock. I'm looking at getting to 100 shares, just reinvesting. Arbor Realty Trust, look at this. I'm going to be earning $43.15. I, I would love to make that on Valentine's Day. No, I don't have a Valentine's Day date. I'm just going to be studying. Um, you know, that's, that's a nice Valentine's day gift right there. $43 and 15 cents key, uh, 927. So you're seeing the compound interest. Everything is reinvesting. So that's the thing. And look, my right here, estimated income is right around two, look at this in April two eighteen forty five. I want to get a lot higher. Again, I want to make a thousand to $3,000 a month, of my monthly dividends and 2000 to $4,000 a month of my quarterly dividends. So let me show you the dividend income for this month. I didn't add Glad, um, and I did sell land. I was making 288. I got rid of them, sold them for store. So Huntington Bank shares, I made 655. Dacom Capital Group, I made 449. Franklin Resources BEN, that's a high yield dividend stock from the financial sector. Check that one out. 1502. Main Street Capital, 14.78 dollars. For fourteen dollars and seventy eight cents, realty income twenty five thirty six, WP carry twenty three oh eight, going up. The EPR, I think I no, I didn't say that yet. Seventeen fifty four, stag six eighty four, store capital eleven eighty one, and believe me, I got a lot more shares now with these guys. So I'm ready for some for more firepower. That way, I can start buying more shares. And again, my goal is to get to a hundred and see what I can do. Maybe even go to 200 and be a more aggressive. Uh, let's see, store capital, we did that. And IVR. So IVR is my big risk stock. I have like a lot of shares in that. And I have and I earn $28.15. And they're a pretty cheap, uh, high-yield uh, mortgage-backed rate right now that took a huge dip during the um, pandemic. Hopefully there's a rebound, but that's my big risk stock. So I calculated everything. I made a total of 153.62. So combination, adding both of those, M1 and E-Trade, 159.61, 153.62, I made a total of, it appears, $313.23. So again, I'm going to reinvest. That's my biggest month. I made it to the $300 mark. And that's not even including my... Um, fundrise, I had to 
pause for a second and think my fundrise portfolio so i didn't even add that up i like to keep that separate from these guys because i like to really focus on the dividend stocks and the passive income with these guys and have a certain goal i mean imagine once i get to a thousand a month how much damage i can do and you know i don't plan on flipping it and just say oh you know i'm going to do this and you know, take the passive income why why not reinvest and make more and treat it as a retirement pension? So you guys let me know how your dividend income came out in the comments section. So again, this is not financial advice for entertainment purposes, only disclaimer in this description. Make sure you smash that like button. You guys have been fantastic. We're gonna probably get to 8,000 subscribers and everything's free for you guys. All I ask you to do, watch my videos, all I ask you to do is hit that notification bell so you don't miss future videos and enjoy the ride. I love doing these videos for you guys. I know I'm extremely busy in graduate school, but things are looking pretty good. You guys take care and have a good one.